Hi, this is Sunshadow Tarot with your reading on your special person today. How are you doing? I hope that you're having a wonderful day, but I also know that when you have your mind on a special person, it's it really is all that is on your mind. And it's uh, sometimes hard to concentrate on other things because maybe you get a text or a phone call, a letter, or you had some kind of interaction with them today. And you really want to know how to interpret what's really going on with them. So let's take a deep dive into what your special person is going through today. Just one more shuffle. Ah, two more shuffles for good luck. Three more shuffles for good measure. Okay. Ooh. Eight of Cups. Justice. King of Swords. Well, has your, uh, person gotten some kind of a notice or looks like uh, they had a conversation that was kind of disappointing to them that they may have wanted to walk away from instead of confront the person that was really acting quite authoritarian with them. So somebody has confronted them today and they may of course they may not tell you but someone has confronted them today in a way that was rather boss-like um, rather authoritarian and um, really maybe even condescending that may have put them in a bit of a, a an sour or offish mood that really hmm I want to get a little bit deeper into that. Oh, wow. The Ten of Cups, the Devil. Strength. Well, again, it looks like they tried to have maybe a happy morning, but uh, someone really kind of put it to them in some way, and they really had to endure something. It may have been small. It may have been a small slight, but when you're talking to them, be aware that somebody could have already crossed them early today. And it really may have made them think, well, you know, should I, should I really strike back at this person? Um, is it worth the effort to really come back at them and uh, make, you know, make a strong comment or take a strong stand? Or should I just endure it? Let's see some more, because I'm very interested in this now. Three of Wands, Four of Wands, a progression, and the Fool. Again, it looks like they're really trying to hold it together and trying to make the best out of things, trying to see the best in <clears throat> perhaps, you know, cooperation with this person trying to stand their ground, but also trying to be cooperative. May have been a co-worker or a client, may have been a friend or family member, um, but they, they sort of got thrown into this uh, unknown territory that they're, I don't think they're very comfortable with. What do you think? Have you seen any indication of this in their behavior today? If you have, you know, Please say it in the comments. Ace of Swords. Oh, wow. Nine of Swords. And another nine. Nine of Wands. Certainly, they are on the defensive. They may be putting up a very good front for you. But, wow, it really looks like whatever these this person said or 
these two people, this may be two people or one person, somebody came at them right away, first thing. Maybe it was an email or a call. It could have been somebody just passing in the hallway, but somebody, somebody came at them right away. And it really, you know, just one, one, you know, one comment could just upset your day. One wrong look could just upset your day. And I don't know if you've seen this from your person or, or your special person has indicated to you that they're under some kind of stress. Um, does this resonate with you? Does this, are you seeing this? Because it seems to be very, very strong here, especially with the devil. Um, and the fool, it, it, they were just immediately taken off their game. And that's, that's quite surprising. I think. Um, wow. I'm really curious about this. Nine of Pentacles. Now look at this. We have nine, nine, nine. Any more nines? Wow. A lot of nine energy. I mean, and two of them very defensive, very, very defensive, very, very, you know, sad almost. So I would reach out, you know, to your person and give them some comfort because it looks like they've already had a hard day and maybe just a kind word or a little special favor would be most appreciative. The Empress and Four of Cups. I would say, you know, your, your person is just not having the greatest day and they would really like to um, straighten this out. That may only be able to come from you um, because This is, uh, this is really something interesting, you know, and, and the fa very fact that they wanted to, they tried so hard to have this really good, good morning and, and trying to, to really make the best of everything. And, and then this person just comes out of the blue, like right off the bat. I mean, that has happened to me, too, and it's just, it's so disconcerting. I don't know if you felt that, but certainly this really, <clears throat> I mean, wrecked their day. And uh, it looks like they really, really wanted to strike out at them, but, but they were really holding back and trying to do just the best they could. Wow. Wow. So, here's the last card. Three of Cups. Maybe, you know, it would be a good idea to take them out. Um, you know, for just for a treat or something like that. Buy them an extra coffee or buy them a snack or take them out to dinner or, you know, something to distract them from this because it really has thrown them off their game. So, I'd like to just draw another card right now because this is so important you know people they they hide things and um you know even if they say are you all right you know you, if they say oh yeah i'm all right you know i think you should you should press it a little bit say you sure you sure you're all right because um you really want to make sure because this is this, some, this is very the devil and and the nine of of swords. That's very severe. And if somebody's repressing something like that, some kind of hurt like that, or some kind of shame, um, because somebody said something. I mean, they really need some support. So I think you know it's best to uh, to do something to to help them nature you may want to just take them for a little walk 
out, you know, if there's just some grass, you know, even I know some people work in an industrial park, maybe if there's just a little bit of something, just a little drive or a little walk, just a little fresh air um, could make all the difference in the world. Um, because look, you know, somebody just, you know, you're working in an office or you're working in, or you're in at home. And you're just in that really repressive environment and you're in four walls and you don't know what to do. And then suddenly, you know, somebody comes at you and there's like nowhere to turn. Somebody has to come and, and offer some kind of a break because otherwise you're just going to feel so closed in. And it's important, so important to be the one, you know, to say, hey, you know, you can lean on me. Let's look at this card here. Take a chance. Yeah, I would say definitely take the chance to reach out to them because it's so, so important. Um, you want to bring them to the state of happiness that they, they, they tried to start out the day with. Um, and, and you don't want to, you want to re, you know, to rebalance their energy for goodness sake uh, it's uh it's just amazing how some people can be so you know inconsiderate and just you know i bet you this person just even started out the date like i'm gonna i'm gonna wreck this person's day um because that's that's the way it feels it really feels like wow this was uh this was something that, that wasn't necessarily, you know, just random. This was something that was thought about. It had some, some premeditation here. And, uh, I, you know, you have to have some, some kind of way of, of defending against that. Because I think they really feel backed into a corner. So take them out. Take a chance and, and, and reach out to them. And, and try to make things happier because this is really uh, something I, I mean I wouldn't tolerate it if, if anybody came at one of my friends or my special person like this you know you definitely have to go to their defense even if you're not necessarily confronting that person you really want to take a stand and and make sure that your person knows how you feel and that they can depend on you all right so that's it for right now um this was really very interesting i don't know if you felt that way if you'd feel that way please make a comment um i don't know if you you felt this kind of energy today it would be uh really interesting if you did um once again if you've if you've seen a couple of my videos um please take a chance on me take a chance take a chance on me and subscribe um and if you have subscribed thank you thank you so much i really appreciate it um because you're all so fabulous this is a wonderful spiritual community that we're building here and uh if you take a look at the subscribers just really just wonderful perf performers and business people and 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 entrepreneurs and creators so so insanely creative Okay, and uh, you can get a personal reading from me at Fiverr, Sunshadow7. That's my, my name over there. Okay, have a really good day and make sure that you reach out to your special person today and, and offer them some comfort. It's really, really important. All right, I'll see you soon. Thanks so much. Have a great day. I wish you much peace and much, much, much love.